All right, little cherry bomb going up in here from the Runaways. I am Finbar of Finbar Base. All right, so what are those lessons all about down there when you click in the YouTube text box right down there? You should definitely do that if you haven't already. There are some really fun lessons uh, for beginners on there. There's one for intermediate, for more advanced players. Uh, for instance, there's a lesson on the floating thumb technique, right? Which is a cool right hand, or actually a uh, plucking hand technique, I should say, if you're lefty, it'll be your left hand, right hand, righty, you'll probably be your right hand. But it's a way to mute the strings out, to keep your hand in a natural position. It's the way that I play bass. I love it a lot. It's not the only way, of course, but these tips and tricks can kind of catapult you sort of like into the next level, make your playing sound more professional and make those notes really ring out. Um, it's helped a lot of people out. And that's just one of the lessons, you know, that's just an example. But it's basically, again, about, you know, having fun, getting better on the bass and playing some music. All right, when this song starts off, you're on the uh, seventh fret of the E string right here. And you're really just doing some eighth notes on that. So just roll along with the beat. And then the next thing you're going to hear, that's uh, there's actually four measures of that, <clears throat> of eighth notes. And then the next thing you're going to hear is this situation. Right, that probably sounds familiar to you if you're trying to listen to this, this song. Um, you're going to hit the, that's the seventh fret eight times, right? You know, normal measure right there, eighth notes. But then you're going to hit it six more times. And then you're going to go to that uh, fifth fret of the A string, right? And you're going to do that whole thing. I'll, I'll show you what the whole thing looks like. Right? And you're going to do that three times. And then on the last measure, you're not going to do this. You're not going to go to that fifth fret of the A string. You're just going to do this number right here. Right? So you hit a normal, you know, measure eighth notes. Then you're going to hit it five more times. Pause and then hit it again. So if I play those all together, Just like that. And then for the, the first uh, chorus, you're gonna be on that second fret of the E string, right? Then you're gonna hit it two more times. Then go to the fifth fret of the E string. So you got, and you can put little fills in here if you want. You can do the old uh, climb up chromatically, right? Something like that. There, I went from the fifth to the fourth to the second fret on the A string. But anyway, <clears throat> the basic is uh, you're going to be on the second fret, then you're going to be on the fifth fret, right? However you get up there. And then you're going to be on the, uh, go from the fifth fret to the seventh fret of the E string. Right? What you're doing there is you're hitting that seventh fret six times. And then you're hitting the uh, seventh, did I say sixth fret? I'm sorry, seventh fret six times. And then you're gonna go to the uh, seventh fret of the A string, right? Just drop down one string and hit that once. <clears throat> and that whole that whole thing uh, sounds like this, this, this part. All right, so you got next part. Just like that. And then there it's going to go back into uh, the part where you're on the 7th uh, fret to the 5th fret. Just like that. And then there's a change when she sings, um, Hey Street Boy, What's Your Style? Uh, there's a little change that goes on. You're going to go to the ninth fret, rises up to the ninth, right here. Right? It's just exactly like what you were doing on the 7th and the 5th fret, but you just go up a whole step, and you're on the 9th and the 7th fret instead. And then, of course, the chorus for that part rises as well, that you're going to do the same thing, but you're going to be on the 4th fret, going to the 7th fret. So you got... Or you could do... What I'm doing there is I'm on the 4th fret of the A, 6th fret, and then 7th fret. And then land on 
that seventh fret of the E string. Then you're going to go up to the ninth fret here, right? Just like we did on the seventh fret before, but you got. So what that is, is you're hitting six hits on the ninth fret of the E. And then just drop it down one string to the ninth fret of the A for one hit. Just like that. All right, really, really fun song, easy to learn. And you got it, yo, from Finbar Bass. Don't forget to click on the YouTube text box right down there. Get those videos if you haven't already. Other than that, have fun with that one, yo. Bye.